All right, what we have here is uh, uh, Dryopteris, Dryopteris goldiana, or Goldie's wood fern. So this is the biggest wood, wood fern in our area. It's kind of later in the season, so it's kind of flopped over, but its normal growth habit is this big vase shape, um, a big vase shape. This is Dryopteris goldiana. Um, so real quick, when we're looking at a fern, this leaf is a frond, this whole thing's a frond. So um, this is a frond, this is a pinna, a pinna. These are the pinna, or pinna, for a singular, pinna, pinna. And then uh, each one of these is a pinnule. So you can see it's, 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 it has these alternate, these very, these alternate, these alternate uh, pinna, alternate. Um, and then they have these alternate pinnules as well. These pinnules that break up. So each one of these, so this is the, Pinnae, and then these are the pinules. And so when we're looking at, at uh, Dryopteris goldiana, the couple things that we see with this is that it, it, it's wide and then it abruptly, on these tops, it abruptly shrinks down into this. this I got one here that really shows that well. Um, but it's wide and then abruptly um, squeezes down. Um, it's gonna have these scales from the bottom all the way up. You can also see that it, it doesn't, it tape, it tapers up to the point, but down here it just kind of kind of ends. It doesn't taper, continue tapering all the way down. It doesn't continue all the way down. Um, what else? Oh, the the little sori are going to be uh, right along that mid that mid rib here on the pinule. See the pinule here. The sori. If we can see this, I don't know if we can see this. Let's put it close. Can you see that? Is that clear? Okay. Yeah something like that all right uh, so it did I move it too quick so if you can look here you can see that that the uh, the sori are really close onto the midrib or that that mid vein there anything else yeah this is a great it's kind of got a dull green color more of a dull, dull green color um, so Goldie's fern there you go. I can't think of anything else. Oh, it grows rhizomatically. Uh, so this is a big cluster and there's some corn over there. So, and it grows in, in rich um, beech maple forest usually. Um, so it likes that, that very rich soil. So cool. Goldie's fern. All right. One more thing. Um, I wanted to point out that uh, some ferns have dimorphic, which is um, they'll have a frond that, that's, that's sterile that looks different than the fertile frond. So on Goldie's, Goldie's wood fern, it is, they are uh, monomorphic, which means that they're, this is a fertile frond. You can see the, the sori on here. I'm sorry. Uh, and then on the, if it's the, like the, the non, the sterile fronds are gonna look just like the fertile fronds. So monomorphic compared to dimorphic, these are monomorphic. So cool, it's a cool plant, really cool fern.